Life is so fucking hard. There's so much pain and suffering, especially for a man in life. I've been stabbed. I've been shot at. I've been run over. I've been hit in the back of the head with a sledgehammer right here in the front of the face with a tomahawk. I've overdosed on heroin. I've been clinically dead. I've been beaten to a pulp. I've been hit over the head with a freaking log. I've been in car accidents. I've seen somebody slice open someone's stomach and intestines fall out. I watched a friend stab another friend in the heart with a chef knife. I've had a friend die in my arms, frothing at the mouth, watch them pass and leave this world. I've had my heart broken. I've been homeless. I can't afford food for days. We've all been through so much shit, pain and suffering. But we have a choice. Life is a choice. We can turn our thoughts around. We can turn our perceptions and procedures and behavior around. We can take the time to make better decisions by directing our thoughts, by changing our habits, by reconditioning our unconscious behavior, by breaking free from the shackles of apathy and struggle and pain. You've heard me say before, if you watch my content, pain is given, but suffering is a choice. You're suffering right now it's because you're focusing on the pain and what you don't want or you're ignoring it rather than focusing on what you do want, focusing on what you do have, being grateful for that, and focusing forward, focusing on the future. When Ragnar Lothbrok leaves Karakut with his two young boys to go to war, they look back at his mum, and Ragnar says, don't look back when you're going that way. Stop looking backwards, stop focusing on the pain, cease the suffering by focus forward. If you have breath, there is hope, you just have to decide. When I decided to no longer be broke, I become a millionaire. When I decided to no longer live on the streets, struggling, I traveled the world. I've done nearly 50 countries the last decade, living my dreams. I've now met a beautiful woman, fall madly in love. I've got more money than I need. I have clients in 20 countries, are helping people all across the globe, or sponsoring an orphanage in the Philippines. You're here for a reason. Remember that. You've just got to decide right now, enough is enough. What are you going to do today to turn your life around?